Hi guys, and today we are doing another maths video. Yet again, it's quite a hard question. Honestly, it was it actually was a very hard question, but then like it's actually part of our extra bonus questions in our math, right? And uh yeah, it's a really tricky question and uh yeah if you guys know this one, like that question is gonna be so easy when you, the next time you see the question, you're gonna be like, wow, it's so easy. But anyway, let's get right into the video. Okay, so now I'm going to read you the question. Farmer Barry has chickens, goats, and cows on his farm. There are twice as many chickens as cows. He realizes that there are 18 heads and 52 legs among the animals. How many goats are there on his farm? So first, you got to draw the model. So this is how your, your model will look like. So, because since they sit on the... Since they said that there are twice um, as many chickens as cows, right? So, you would draw chickens as two units and cows as one unit. But, as you guys know, we don't know what goats are. So, we'll just put goat there, but then we, will, we won't know what they are. And you'll put the total heads as 18. You have to draw the model for the legs. So, the chicken legs should have four units. For the chicken legs, the reason why we have four units is because... Chickens have two legs, and since we have two units, we have to draw four units. So since we have only one cow unit, and then one cow has four legs, so we'll put the cow the cow leg units as four. And then, since goats, right, they also have four legs, but we don't know how much they have, so we'll put there as four goat leg units. And also the total legs as 52. So for step 3, you have to multiply first model by 4. So it means this model right over here, with the means the head model, the, the chicken cow and goat head model. So right, you, have to, you want to multiply it by 4. So 18 times 4 will be 72. Mm -hmm. So that means you have a total of 8 units for the chickens and a total of 4 units for the cows. And also, now since, we, since on the last model we had only 1 goat unit, that means we have four gold units in this model. So you might be wondering why multiply by four? You can multiply by five, two, and some other number, right? But this is the reason why. Since gold, we have no clue about it, right? So since there were four leg gold, since there were four gold leg units, right? For um step two, means the the chicken cow and gold leg model, right? There were four gold leg units. So that means we we want to make it equal. So we will multiply by 4 to have 4 goat head units. And since we multiply by 4, the total will be 72. But you will want to take this equation right over here and minus that equation right over there so we can get rid of the goats and we'll find how much one unit is. So, now we will take 12 units minus 8 units which equals to 20. And since 12 minus 8 equals to 4, that means 4 units will equal to 20. So now, it's pretty easy to find unit. You take 20, divide by 4 to get 5. That means cows will be equal to 5 since there are only 1 unit for cows. You'll know how much chickens are. So, so, so there will be chickens will be 10 since there were, since chickens has twice as many as cows. So that means there will be 10 chickens. And to find goats, since there were 18 heads, right? Means each, each animal have 1 head. So that means there are a total of 15 heads right now. So that means there's only one answer, means there are three goats. So this is how you do the question.